Hi, welcome to another series of Mastering Windows Active Directory. In this video, we will learn how to add a domain controller to an existing domain in the forest through PowerShell. First off, we will start with a clean installation of Windows Server, preferably the Core Edition. We name the computer to represent the domain controller that would be the second VC in the domain. Then we assign a statistic IP address to the server and configure the DNS to your primary domain controller, which you can learn more about here. After we have finished preparing the server, we start the server for the settings to take effect. Now we need to set the time zone for the server. In our example, we will set it to Mountain Standard Time. Add the Active Directory Domain Service role to the server by also including the management tools. Then the most important part of this video like when we add the first domain to the forest, but this time we specify it as a domain controller using the same domain name and also providing the domain administrator credentials. This is so that this server will be part of the existing domain acting as a domain controller. After everything has been installed correctly, we need to validate that all servers are running. Check if the SMB shared is correctly configured. And finally, validate the event log for any unusual warnings during the process of configuring your domain controller. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you like this video, please press a like and please subscribe to watch for more future content.